there I be? Oop. Right, I did everything but load the game. But there I be. In the previous session of the Long War campaign, as we get at John Cena's, um, eventually. The long strokes. There it is. This entire stream is already going off the rails. Great, long war is our spawning. Oh, that, was, that was weird. That was odd. Right, previous session of Long War, long string of missions. We um, had, I want to say six missions in quick succession, and it's, it's a couple of days after that, so. That the 4th, the 11th, the 13th, the 15th. This is a long set of missions. We're up to the 27th. We have a landed um, raider ship. Bludgeon, uh, the Abyssal Bludgeon. I already talked about this, the mirror back spiders. You cast Venge, you hit them. You're, you do max damage. The recoil from the bench kills the spider. You could do a rain switch and bring like a ballista and drink a, a range pot. And that should do enough damage to one shot, but... The range spider, he does deal with. You can either kill them with with a ballista drinking a range pot that should do enough damage I think if you're if you have a high enough range level but alternatively you can either kill the, the egg before it hatches or um, lure the the red explosion spider to the to the green um, spider egg and that will do enough damage that it won't spawn you can do one of the three things. There's options. Then either kill the range spider of melee, punch it a couple times, I mean, bop it a couple times with your weapon, or um, lure the... lure the red spider to the egg and that'll do enough damage that it won't even try to spawn. Right. No, I'm not done being derailed. No, I'm done... Explain the gist of what's happened. We were searching the plot, the plot research that'll eventually get us to to base assaults. I do have to consider a Lyrum at some point because that will give us more armor options as well as um, we'll eventually get power systems going, which will also open up more armor options. We're not rewiring the march. Canonically, if we fail the, the, the a future event, which I'm not going to spoil, then yes, we may end up going back to March, or I may end up vetoing it. I'm not sure. Hey, Belt. I saw our, I saw your uh, your tag team match. I guess a four way tornado tag match. That um, Bursker set up and I hear else about like I say, it's, I was rooting for you guys, for even though I may have bet it for um, for Cam and Titan and Trevor, but I was rooting for you guys in spirit. Also, I know we also I know we lost our match unfortunately. We got the roll of pen. But he definitely did put up a good match, so I was I rooted for you in spirit, even though I bet it against you. Was that that? Oh no, I I derailed myself, and not in honesty. But we did a long string of missions. We set up advanced gods. We're getting our GLR coin, which will help with mechs, with mechs in particular. And our barracks is more or less clear, except for injuries, which still hurts for Jason, at least, and Rebel, and um, I think actual Bursker comes back soon. Um, Bursker to the infantry. I think they're clear like, within a week? Yeah, within five days. That hurts, that hurts. And the rest, I think, are just fatigue injuries that I had to do for the, the bomb disposal.
I'm just... Right, it's six power. Yeah, I was gonna say it's a lot more power source than I was thinking for, um... Was it six or was it four? Six. Yeah, where you... Uh, we're, I'll let Future be worried about that, but for now... Did I not? Hold up. Apparently Pass Me didn't save. Wait, did I? No, apparently Pass Me used and did not save, so we're at the 21st before... Um, so, so I'm not sure what's gonna happen next, if... Stuff will go according to plan, because I currently passed me was dead tired after Friday's after um, Thursday's session. Contact yeah. Never mind. Contact That's the same UFO that we ended on, so just distracted as per as per usual. But nobody comes back in 15, right? I come back in six. I'm not close to being promoted, so I'm not really going to be an option for this. We're definitely sending Bull. I'm just double checking if how close people are to promotions. How did you? How did you not get promoted? Oh, you're on two missions, but you didn't get enough experience. I guess someone must have got injured on your second op. Mm. Alright, for, for real this time, let's actually do a, a mission for once. I think we started the request two for the sector capture, like from that session. In five days. LA's for a terrible trade, mailed we Definitely don't want to give up for two scientists. His UK is maxed out pretty much. Contact detected. Okay, for real, for real this time. Sengar Bold. How many? Out of curiosity, because again, there's still a possibility that this could be trapped. It won't be as terrible as a rate as a, a tarped um, raider ship. Yeah, as that's a lot more tame than up to forty. Oh, so yes, I said that's that's why I said forty on the on the raider ship. Cause that's very unbalanced. Thank Greek Liam. Probably double menace, I think. Wow. Well, I forget who can't promote. Well, it wouldn't be him. It would be, um... Oh, there's someone, there's someone that is petite. Yeah. I mean, I could just bring two training medics to train up to eventually be an office medic. Yeah, why not? Anti scale, two medics. Cyber is gonna be this person that we're training up. Um, our assault will be. John Cena. I definitely want a rocket just in case. Maybe I want to train up. Because my other ones are sort of injured and I don't, I don't want to save Apple Wolf just in case, just for the covert up.
and both my mechs are fatiguing if I'm Yeah, you're you're fatiguing for for voice but two. I had gunner death. We're saving Thorn so this corporal is our gunner. I think he went to armor's patch up, I think. Yeah, armor's patch up. Cool. Sanger takes a capture device. All goes according to plan, Sangar, I mean, not Sangar, Bald will be, Bald will have enough experience to get the, will have enough experience to get concealment finally. The game only tried to kill you once, and that's because, again, that trap raider had a really early um, heavy floater. Although in hindsight, I forgot the rule that trap UFOs can have early aliens early than expected, but I still wasn't expecting a heavy floater to to pop up. So it spooked me. I was thinking if. The floater did. When I was looking back on the footage, I was thinking that the floater didn't like reveal Jason that we could have maneuvered better, but it did the opposite. The floater did opposite of what I expected it to do, so it happens. Just got in a bad spot. Alright, enjoy the lurk world. We will not get you killed because we actually we 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 legitimately don't want you to get injured because we're gonna need you for our future ops. Wait, where's my disco stick? Specialist and specialist. Soon I'll be able to actually get recoil this rifle and that will make things a lot better. Like we have the potential to actually up our ground game a little bit with... I still take the laser gun. We still have the opportunity to up our air game, up our ground game with the improved rocket launcher, but again, we're allies starved, so we're still working with, with what we got. All right, Sangar has captured a vice. Bolt has a scout collar. Neck hits and spokes. You realistically don't need that. No, not that. Let's take a scope. So I want to make sure the gunner actually can't hit the target since they don't have double tap. Oh, you're going to be a tandem rockets here. That's going to be spicy. Whereas I never checked what your skill tree was because I wasn't sure if rocketeer was going was gonna to live or not. Alright, so everyone else is pretty much set up. Tell you what, we don't need two spokes and two different people. Liam is gonna have a, a um, cam. Because someone needs to hold on to it. And you're gonna have a flashback. Alright, this looks, this looks better. 
Alright. Off you guys go. Oh, the shy spot. Strike one. Prepare I forgot. Landing. I have Gauss guys a handout. I mean Gauss rifles a handout. And it let it out. Well, there's my dirt for the day. Liam, you uh not you. That gunner. That sniper, or not Dolan. Um, it was the other, other sniper. Anti medic, anti double medic, gunner, sniper, assault. Oh, that, uh, the person that should go on a mission in the first place. Hey, bass bites. Yeah, I apologize for being the, I guess, the laid out of the bunch, but I've also been meaning to add to the to ghost, not ghost bridges, to add to, um, G Rambles Discord bit. I'm still finding the words for um the, the starting bonus I'm working with, the resourcefulness. Like I have an idea, but I'm trying to think if I want to make it serious or like semi-serious, like um like Commissar's um thing he did. Right, Goss Guns. I wish I had the Goss Shoddy right about now, but I don't. I mean, everyone's aim is sort of... middle of the road. You know what, take a Gauss Rifle, sure. And everyone else just has like 70-ish aim, so I think they need the extra accuracy to not miss their shots. Yeah, let's we'll go with this. We only need one Gauss gun and that should be the gunner if I'm not paranoid. Yeah, I should be paranoid, honestly. Alright, now we're ready. We're trying to make the Canada Advanced Prep Start work. I think it's good. I think the ready start tonight is going to be good. We have visual on the mission site. Setting down. The Our advanced... site is near the German border. I forget, the advanced start is... Indicate the UFO you set begin with a lab in the workshop. We need to the ready belts, I think. The invaders. Or am I thinking of a different starting bonus? I mean, different, um... Yeah. Oh, it is that one. For some reason, I was thinking the other one where you start with corporals or something like that. Or unless I'm misremembering, um... Something from Rebalance. HQ, this is Big Sky. We are in position and awaiting further orders. Roger that, Big Sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. That is the other one. Okay, then, um... Current enemy status at the site. Brain scatter brain. Unknown. It. It's a tank. Affirmativo. Right, so there's a pod over there. That's out of curiosity. This is a landed scale could have between 19 and 11. If it's trapped, it's a different story. 
So we'll take this cautiously because again, I'm having to... I don't want to repeat of last time. Where we had a run within like the first couple turns. Oh yeah, you should totally join a barracks. We already have Commissar and voice. Alright, we'll add you in after the words. We'll add you in once we're done with the scout. Heading out. Right, so the mini two goals survive. Make sure Bulk is promoted and maybe capture a sex weight for resources. On my way. I'd rather push you there to set up shop next turn. You're ready to say, all right, everyone else is our watch on. Dead man. Affirmative. Pink was there. Am I gonna try to be aggressive and try to get him out? Assuming it's not trapped. Refund his flies. <laughs> It's an open field, but you have to keep in mind our guys are sort of short sighted. And I don't worry, I won't forget. I mean, to be fair, actually, I'm not sure what time we started this base assault. I mean, this um, UFO um, recovery at. This is not like um, the external files where our guys were blind as a bat when we did like early, early um, night ops. So that's where the pod's at. I wet gunner, go sit there so you can try to see next turn. And you're gonna swivel so you can see. Got it covered. I'm on it, Commander. Um You get more vision range if you equip the bear and sun cells, the sun sunglasses. I mean, you're not wrong. Good copy, moving on target. In UFO defense, it being nine times means that it's harder for your guys to see. And in the early game, especially against aliens, you're not gonna, they're gonna see you before you see them. If I was smart, I would have thrown this bomb. They're gonna run into us, so it's not really a concern. Although, honestly, John Cena should be behind that so he doesn't get flank shot. Because we're playing with a bunch of sick, with a bunch of second wave options. If you trigger tentacles, one of them. Hey, you hear anything? Oh, so hold on.
All right, I'm back. <laughs> I'm so by in the kitchen. I wish. Now I had to deal with another bug because the fun of late summer where bugs love to just get in the house and I'm the only one that could swing those fly swatter reliably, so it is what it is. I wish it was fly. Although I do have a pretzel that I'm tempted to eat later, but sadly it's not that. We're gonna have a cheap steak center watching games. Nice. Okay. Since they're not playing ball, we're gonna throw a scatter out there. Because we're at the point where um Dimmins can be the leader to Dimmins can be a sniper, which is a little scary. Alright, so have they moved or are they just being stationary? Oh, that's a disc. Can you see the disc? No, you cannot see the disc because reasons. Can you see the disc? I swear, covers occur sometimes. It's playing. No, it's because the logs in the way. That's why you don't see it. Um, the mech suit we don't have because the two people that can use it are recovering from being used extensively in the field. I have to keep, have to keep in mind you're not a specialist, so you're not gonna one shot the. You're not gonna one shot that thing. Can I kick it off with, with a shredder rocket? It did in our It did because ours was special. In long war and enemy unknown our specialty is we have a person in an exosuit i'm curious if this is trapped or not now if you haven't seen our exosuits then we'll i'll say you'll be a well before we use them but they're Pretty awesome. Yeah, heat gunner's a little bit out of position. Moving. All right, fine, you go there, Dan. Okay, or not. All right, so. I'm on the move. We probably hold for one more turn, see what happens, and we try to kick this off and probably let them come to us, because I don't have my usual 18 with us. I'm on it, Commander. No, they want to be stationary. Got it. The shredder would work. That produces that angle. And the camera trans tells there's thin mints over there, maybe.
So it's pretty much a matter of do I want to commit now, backpedal, and see what happens. I'm starting to look that way. Yeah, I think that's what I do. And we should be fine. I mean, I can also just smoke, but have hit some people back up so that they're not clumped together for a grenade. I think it's bison. It, Rebel, sh Rebel knows that it took me a while to accept uh, the filters and everything, because trust me, my audio sounded a lot worse back in the day. Especially during pers the Persona 5 playthrough I did um, last year. Yeah, I think we just commit. So fire that shred. This. That's I got a visual. Give me options. Let's me see everything but what's important in life. What does the gunner say? The gunner sees a 49, a 58. A 59, my bad. 59, 89, because that's landed. Okay. Go for the one and landed then. Um, sniper, deal with... Oh, that is added. Okay, you're actually just bad. Gutter's accuracy is just bad. I wish you could hit the flying one, but you can't. Alright. Um, what are the other shots? Back at a 39. I forget, Sengar has just mayhem grenades, right? Yes. Go for the land of one then. Yeah, not quite. Damn it, the yeah, go for that one then. Oh, damn it. Could a, a mayhem grenade change things? Worry about that tree actually being what stops us from seeing the. No, this is too far away. You're going smoke. You have to move. That should be fine. Go for that. Um, wait. Yeah, you're throwing a grenade. That should kill those two, so go for the Roomba.
And as for John Cena, um... Fall back or watch. Um, I should have had him take a pistol shot first. I forgot he has hull targeting. Alright, you're gonna throw your grenade then. That should kill those two because they're shredded and... This is an 8 damage grenade. Falls a lot more than I thought it was going to. Um, all right, I threw my plan off a little bit. Something like that. A little bit worried, but it should still be fine. There's a red dog. I figured that was going to happen. Interesting. Alright, question is, what are you going to do? Okay, we can work with that. They all went to our watch. Wait, haven't we done a um Haven't we done a disc autopsy? No, I'm thinking of something else entirely. Okay. Is bald. Not that I want to run this immediately because if he does, he'll get killed. He'll definitely get killed by the the disc. But uh, not you. The bottle run to there. I need to kill from the the seekers first. And red right in hope that a grenade does a trick, we're gonna do a rocket instead. Something like something like that should do. Won't even know what hit him. There we go, that's the damage we need. Cool. Right, Sangor sees it from there. You don't see it from there. Yeah, that goes through the smoke wall should be fine. Go to there. Ooh, that's still six percent. Okay, good. Man, I'm gonna surprise if things all wrong, but take that shot. Really, dude, negative. Wow, I'm surprised the distance closed out of pity for that, but that honestly sucks.
we go there, we, we definitely get killed. I also do realize he's asking for a grenade for us to get hit by a grenade, but... Yeah, the fail when your sniper does negative damage to an exposed cyber disk. <sighs> if anything, I'm more disappointed in myself for thinking that would do damage. Yeah, Liam, you need to fall back. You're in a bad spot. Heading to that location. At best, it runs into the Overwatch fire at worst, so someone's gonna get um. So I'll make it flank shot. Um, the gunner make it flank shot. Hey Ross, you're in the middle of awkward times. We caught a disc in the weird spot and it our team failed to deliver a number of things yeah fall back bolt yeah on a scale of a one to five it's about two ghost screams yeah fair I mean, he went forward, then fell back. Okay, this is at least playing nice. Okay, he did more than just no damage. And those those dimmits are about to activate pretty soon. Okay, make ready. That reveals it. Oh, frick. This got from bad to worse. That's fair. I feel like my sniper can't do squat. Like, I don't think it's a specialist disc. I think it's just we're low bowling our shots at shit hit, but aren't. And we have this that may we have demons that may be within flanking range this turn. Destroy that out there as well. So not ideal, but we'll do our best. The, ru the rumors are gonna Guys. kill some of that damage we just dealt. Fall back and steady, you may have to fight another rocket. Good to go. Yeah, there's no way Liam's getting there without getting killed by the, the Roombas. He said I was shielding, I just gotta survive. I mean, fair, but... Bruh. I'm 
Our necessary shield shredded for our turn, so we just start just lowballing our shred our um, damage shots on a shredded disc. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I still shredded, just doing negative damage on it mostly. I need the I need the medics to try to just distract the lit um, the demons sort of. Question is: Is this still going to play nice, or is it going to want to do something? Okay, that's not that bad, but it hurts. You're going to try at the worst possible time, just let you know. Alright, well... I hate banking on a new Rocketeer, but I'm gonna have to bank in you a little bit to maybe do your job. Suck on this. See no, this? Just... This is my boom. You just want to commit tree murder. You have to be at least five tiles closer, realistically. I mean, maybe if I bounce it up the tree, but that's a little bit risky. I can see what the angle is at the very least. Nah, it would just be a kill for on the Roomba. I mean, at this point, softening it from healing it would be the better play, so go for it. Okay, bar. Or their DR is just gonna be the bane of my existence for another turn. Keep that thing pinned, we'll keep you go get you patched up in a second. Could use some ammo here. Oh, so I think that's your last suppression you can do, right? No, I think you have one more in you. up next turn. Heading there now. I'm not sure what those stimmers are doing, but I'm not really like convinced they're doing they're gonna wait around for us. It just hurts seeing all that dash get patched up because we failed to deal with the the Roombas. 17%. Okay, and that's good. Kill confirm the drone or No, it lost a stretch. Chess bot. Oh, that's fun. 
Oh, there's an eye bison. Could I still suppress? One more suppress it is it'll be it's gonna be um uncontained. Yeah, you have to go for it. There's damage. Wish that was when it was shredded, but it's damage. Go for the drone. No oh, dice. You had to suppress. And I need you to patch. I'm gonna save a little because I should be able to heal him, but I can't heal the suppressor and I can't. And if I can't, then well, I can't because I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna load the auto save. They're at the hunger if, I, if they can't. No, I rewinded a second and no, the game saying no because they... The game saying no because they're technically here suppressing when they're there. Alright, fine. You're technically full cover. Can you deal with the drone? Sort of. It's not gonna heal. You're gonna try. And you guys are watching the six against the mid set. Are still not approaching for whatever reason. I'll, we'll still take it. I'm just not a fan of being in the extended staff by with a disc. Okay, good. You're going to strive for a sniper, but you did your job. So it has to die or someone's gonna get within range of it and it's gonna be bad. Yeah, my sniper went cross-eyed at the worst possible time. Thanks. We need to back up. There's no going around it. Back okay. up, guys. Rock and roll. Solid copy, Commander. We lost control of the disc. I repeat, we lost control of the disc. It's not going to be good. Our diversion was smoke, and our diversion was suppression, and both have not really been beneficial. And I'm worried the medic is going to get sh shot and killed, but we have the other medic, so it's not the it's not the worst, but it's not ideal. It happens. Roomba brain. And now they come up. Sure. I think there are five dens, if I recall.
43 you not dead but they're close to death armor same with life but that hurts a lot <sighs> all right um motion tracker You don't have backup. Yeah, we're gonna kill you then. And all those potential targets I can't kill because the this is the biggest death threat of them all. No way. And you know, pop into me. Sure, that's not good. If only, but that this is the biggest threat. Actually, I give you a med kit, right? No, so you're gonna be stuck for a couple turns. Well, he could patch himself up, but if the disc touches him again, he's dead. But we have suppression. I suppress, I shoot. I hit with Sangra first for the hall target in case it, in case the sniper misses again. We don't worry about the suppression for now. Cypher, please. Okay, pat yourself up. In the desk. That might be a line of sight of something. No, not quite. I just pin against a lot of things at once. Yeah, I need you to deal with the damage ball. You're going that way. I decided the drone's freaking the heck out, so it's not patching up. That's the only good thing about this. But we're about to have a bunch of demons try to interrupt us. Uh, 
Uh, that's really bad. Cypher's tripping out. She's just saying. Well, lots of trees are dying today, but luckily they're not us, so. Your effect, we can't do anything, so just reload your gun. Your gun's dry. In theory, you could flank, but I'm worried you're gonna set off more things, and I'm about to just take that take that worry. If only you didn't get into the acid cloud, I could throw a flashbang to at least stop this, but you effectively can't do anything. head down. Liam's guns try. I saw the grenade. Although I know it's not going to blow this tree up, it had to, it had to be really lucky to do so. Problem is you. I can't afford to take a risk a risk on that right about right now. If I do that, then we split we spot something else, we're screwed. So what I'm thinking of a grenade doing max doing max out shall be next comes. I mean it's gonna wanna run just blank because I don't have anything to counter that. At worst they just shoot at they try to break suppression, but Yeah, you have to suppress a disc. Aye, aye. Too rude. I mean, uh... What's the worst thing you can do if I leave you down? Maybe take off shot on the... I know, all the buttons. Worst thing they can do is they could take a shot on the sniper and I may kill them. But snipers are already pretty much just... ...stuck. Because of the acid. Yeah. 
And realistically, you need to patch the medic. I mean, patch up the gunner next, the assault next turn so they can do their job. Right, so you didn't move then. We throw the grenade on that, we worry about everything else later. RNG did not troll me today. Okay, you're gonna have your head down. I want Ball to be hero, but if they if they go down, this hurts me long a really this hurts me more in the long in the long game. So you're gonna stand there instead. In Overwatch. Okay, that's that's fine. Question is, what are you two gonna do? Of course. Well. Your hair was down, so that's fine. Or watch. Good news, you're fine. Bad news, you're tripping balls, Shell. Right, one went to Aura Watch, one took that shot. Yeah, you're gonna take damage no matter what. You may want to try to kill it from a dim bit, maybe. Oh, when it um, no, I might not. Be, I I won't be able to just extract words. Won't be able to exploit that. I don't think because running to or watching is asking for our ball to get killed. That's all you can see, so just take that shot. Solid. I mean, I have to, right? I have to run the risk of you just panicking from shooting while, I, while I was tripping out. Oh, Didn't panic at least. Oh, that's what sees you. Yeah, okay, that's that's the problem. Oh, so much about Operation Save you. Okay. Two trees are blocking your line of sight. You're not going to be able to do that. Will anyone bring me a disturbly cyber disc? 
I'm trying my best, but my team is really jumping the ball today. The only small mercy is that Roomba's so injured, it's completely lost his mind about trying to, you know, it's lost his mind about trying to patch up the disc. That's the only small mercy I'm getting today. Aye, aye. I wish it was more than that, but the game's not giving me options. Right, if I pass you up, what can you do? You can run against your dad and kill it. But that would open up that that thin dip that thin minute to just run up and just shoot John Cena in the face. So that's gonna keep you out in the open and get you killed, unfortunately. And going there is a very damnly failed um thank shot on the medic. I'm so confident there's another pod back here, and I'm not gonna take the bait. I want to. But I'm not convinced it's, it's just a trap. Okay, new plan. You're gonna actually know. Is it? But it's in line of sight, right? No, it's not. I mean, maybe that gives me options. At the very least, a disc, you won't be exposed entirely. Okay. It's still 6% here. Really, game? Well, so much for you doing something. You're running back to get patched up, because... Ow. That'd be a 30-something you didn't get shot. Alright, back up. Never mind, take it back. All back right. you go. Yeah, about a god. It's fine, it's like it never happened because the um, ball had exact heat, the exact armor damage to make that be super fit shot pass. Take the 44, I guess. You should have to hunker because I can't do anything to save you. Crap, that's the worst case situation. This is uncontained. And Manic is hurting. Oh, this is bad. The Manic's gonna get shot probably by the disc. Okay, you're no longer tripping balls, good. I'm not a fan of being toyed with by the game, but... It, it's still somehow fine. Because this is the scientist to or watch spam us, which I'm fine with.
Wait, the game says you're halt hardy, but you're not. I have questions, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna expect answers. Okay, he's effectively neutered rather than throwing acid. Yeah, the assault is unfortunately still on acid. Because they just reapplied it to his to his face. That man needs to fall back. He's not in range, I don't think. Yeah, you need to try, at least try to do something since that thing's contained now, and so is the drone. Okay, or not. Thank you. I swear, the game's just trying to give me an aneurysm with how incompetent we're acting. All right, drunk this the disc is falling down. Jeebus. And that's the only thing you can see. You might well, well, it's not gonna want to do anything. It's just gonna want to just panic around like a like a derp. Right, you need to back up and patch yourself up because if you get killed, it's bad. Oh, before I do that, your eraser did edge from being flanked, which is also bad. Well, you can do this for real these out, but without getting shot, so. You go out or you get flank killed. You stay still, you may live. His accuracy is down the toilet. He's gonna wanna focus on the on the assault probably, so just patch yourself up. We're now out of the woods, but the enemy's being dumb at the moment. Except for that, great. Solid damage that may make a small difference for what it's trying to do next. You said Liam? Ow. Okay, your guns try. How bad is your shots? Point flips that you will have to take. Move and load. And the gunner silence is bad from the angle, which is surprising. Yeah, you have to do this vault, because that's a flank. Yeah, it's a flank. Okay. That's not a flank. 
Okay, okay. Oh no, it wouldn't be a flank because he's on a he was on a ledge. Alright, that makes never mind, checks out. Salmon. So I got a room, but it's uncontained, but it is has a freshly loaded magazine. Back online. I just realized you do not have Meezy Cash Shoe. That, that's on me. Yeah, you need to do this, son. Nice. All right, he saved himself. Trying to fit me against Sue is as easy as destroying. As knowing Thorne's favorite type of music. Is it metal? Oh, oh I thought you meant Ninja Thorne or um, Liam. Fine, don't you gun. Okay, I have a plan. I'm rolling. Oh, that still puts you in range of that. That's actually bad. I mean, it should be fine still. I think he's gonna still want to throw ass of what I'm planning. Si, senor. If he does, that pretty much still seems my fair finally. Match him up. Man up and get back out there. And you are just an aura watch. Oh, right, I killed it. Things is gonna want to run, actually. There are a lot of rules I'm just missing, as well as um, having a pull back on moment. Yeah, you're, you're just leaving for the outsider. That's fine. You can't do much, just stay still. We'll wait for the dim mints, and I'm, I'm pretty confident this is not trapped. This is just a very uh, awkward moment for Axon for everything that happened in the past hour ish. Not a scout, dealing with a scout. Yeah, feel a little par for the course for our incompetence. As I rehydrate. So we blew all our explosives, all our grenades. We still have the flashbang for the the, the um, outsider. Copy that. Because if this was trapped, we definitely would have saw more action and just demons flying in.
And also, we just have we have just enough medkits to catch the people that matter the most. Okay, you're no longer tripping balls, good. All is well found. Got it covered. Back online. Sound of an angry demon, but that, that's that's the norm. Roger that. I'm on it, Commander. Right, Cyber is where they want to be. Yeah, it's a quarter map. So this going where I wanted balls to go in the first place was safe. I'm just was concerned because of trap potential. Elsewhere, so that's that good actually. Of course, he's up now. I'll get him next time. Oh, that is not good. Please let that be a dash for where you're where I think you're going to. They're on the move. They're falling back. Okay, it was a dash good. Like the one moment I move the medic, the moment he just gets popped. Good to go. Eh, maybe I can notice some. Go. Got him. All right. So this isn't trapped. This should just be the outsiders left. I mean, yeah. Actually, moving there could have been a little bit dangerous. Alright, can we throw it inside the UFO? Just barely. Alright, is it in the UFO? Getting a better look. Survey says it is oh, right there. All right, so we can stick her on the side and ambush it. And if we're lucky, maybe capture it since there wasn't a there wasn't a sex toy on this map. Roger, we'll call. Moving to position. Yeah, 
Alright, just the outsider. But you can see it from here. Alright, the wait, oh we can see we can see it's rank. Okay, it's not scary. It has opportunists, that's about it. That works with our sight. Servants? I'm sort of curious. Was, was there a bell on the rooftop? Does Venus see the bell cam? I'm not even sure what a mouth can is. It's gonna be somewhere silly where I least expect it, because I didn't hear it ping the entire time, which means it obviously expired by now, but I just figured I would see it because it's a very small map. Before I can, before I end the turn and lose the dial scanner, it's range with that squad side, not um, it's not LMB LMG range just yet. Probably wouldn't be range. That would be that would be visual range for sure. Maybe there, but that's not a like angle. I don't think. Yeah, don't worry about it just yet. Load. That might be range, but if it scatters to here, then it's not going to be range anymore. The best I'll be able to do just stand there and steady. Attempt to try to get it. Um, I think how I'm gonna do this is I'm gonna have not you. I'm gonna have the medic go around to spot.
spot it from like here to push it toward them and we'll go from there. Maybe I'll help the gunner get a suppression light, um, angle on it. Can I help a rebel? We got... We got trolled big time by a cyber disc. And we had to pull back some on it. Can't do much about that. We should be lucky it's not trapped. It didn't have heavy floaters in it just to scare me, just to scare me more. Uh, so yes, you missed a heavy floater. No, we're not going to discuss it because it's scary. It was a very scary um, moment that we don't want to rehash again. Yeah, imagine if you're wise to the start of the mission. Maybe? Um. Oh, they're actually be fine. I should be glad I'm not really... I haven't activated the outsider just yet. Because, you know, strategy. It's a thing that exists. You're already steady, right? You're not. Oh, Actually, with this... No. Oh. Okay, apparently I was wrong on that fact. That probably will, so go to there then. Yeah, no. uh, things I did just to spook an outsider. Okay, that definitely will. All right, we're we're getting there. You moved, you moved in the wrong spot. Or the right spot. You know, you. Wow. Well, Well, would that be a flashbang spot? No, because throwing grenades are hard sometimes, I understand. But it's definitely a tanky outsider now. But I have no way to to hurt to um neuter, unfortunately, which is gonna suck.
I believe all, but at the same time, we're trying to get you in killed. Scout caller or not? The flashlight would be ideal, and uh, we're well, obviously not gonna get a cab on it. Well, maybe. We should get in to actually throw the thing. No, you're gonna have the same situation. Uh, that maybe? No, not even close. Obviously, Sangor score on the side. Wait, no, that's a bad idea. Yeah. We're going around to there. I don't know how that's full cover, but I'm going to sit there and see what see what angle that is, because I'm yeah. I was gonna say that's confusing angle to take. Well, you need to hide. You hug, you, you may be dead, but that's the best I'm gonna be able to do with you. There, Rebel. Alright, you went the other way, sure. Oh no, that may be too much damage. Just straight up kills the rockets here. And I didn't think he crit kill. And that's why outsiders are special are dangerous. And if you want to. I would say a rebel wants it, but I think rebel is rebel already shut his computer off. Let's say, let's say, man. All right, I can respect it. Back to that, which was before we activated in the first place. I think. Okay, so in this reality, we're gonna go around to this side to push them out. Already there. Yeah, that's why outsiders are scary. They are really accurate. I could actually at least put you in a route that angle to do your thing. And that's not even a scary outsider, too. That's just a... That's a singular outsider that hit on full cover, so that... There's not really much you can do about that except this smile and shrug. Confirm. 
confirmed. Closing on target position now. Just got hot in here. Okay, that's how I push them out to where we can actually suppress. Oh no, I lied because you don't. I swear, our game's trolling me today. We see him, we don't. That's the part where we somehow don't see that the uh, outsider. Because he's like, I think there and Gunner is having a is being blind at the moment. Yeah, the gunner's being blind. The gunner's gonna die in a second because reasons. Well, not really reasons, but just line of sight. It it exists. Out. Oh, I was a terror. All right, I was a terror angle angle often. Sure. The irony is if I didn't run to where I was supposed to run, I probably could have just flashbanged it from there. Yes, Commander. I'm rolling. Yeah, this might end up the exact same way because it's uncontained. Like playing hide and seek with an outsider that's actually not being in the ship. It's a terror. It's a terrifying prospect. Just saying. Okay. It's raining death over here. Oh hi. Is this a flashbang range? Uh, not close. I mean, not close enough. this prospect I'm doing right now. This stream's terrible idea, by the way. But it's gonna want to move first before it wants to do anything else, so it's not gonna want to move in the ship, I hope. On the move. 
on the move. That's a bald hide. Really, you panic on it. Well, you're not dead, but it hurts. Any rainbow. I can tell you about my Goss economics. We have a Goss long rifle being built, and we have. Well, that's about it. But it's economics. Also, the gunner panicking at close range is definitely not ideal. But we also have a couple rifles and we have a machine gun. Also, I wish we'd done more than two hours in just a single scout ship, but... I said new-ish people thinking this would be an easy training mission and it's turned into anything, but... My team has had severe difficulties killing a disc and a couple of dimmits. It definitely has not been a good day for the team. You're a dodge boy, a damage boy, blame the sniper on that. I mean, yeah, it's not your fault, it's just the fact that my sniper gonna hit their shot, my gunner, um... My sniper couldn't suppress... Oh, a lot of things. Sniper failed to do damage. Tread, even with tread. Yeah, whenever we did hit shots, we just low the damage, so... Typical asshole moment. The emphasis of Hope XCOM, where our shots either hit or just bounce. No in betweens, unfortunately. Roger, it's flashbang, but I'm not really that sure on that. Uh, no, it's a it's a newer um, cyber we're trying to train up because we have Ross and Leisher maxed out The sniper has decent aim And stability so the standard stuff but just lowballed on a on a shred on a shredded disc Case in point, we went, we actually no, that's a that's a laser yeah, that's a laser carbine. Never mind. Um, ball just hide. It's going well. Um, we dealt with the, the council mission. We did the bomb disposal, and we already did double terror. Um, we dealt with double terror in quick succession. We had um, uh, not to derail my own, my own stuff, but I'll clip. I'll sh post this, and you can think about how the what the terror missions went. Surprisingly, that one went well. The other one, um... 
turn into a Crystal Infestation. They both targeted Mexico, but the sec the one I clip actually was the better result of the two terror attacks. That one had 12 lids, by the way. Nine lids in that room, three lids in a adjacent room that aggro the same turn. Uh, the following turn. Also, we're really gonna play this outsider. I just want to catch here, just to at least feel better about myself. Oh yeah. Uh, also, we um, in that slug of missions, of four, four, or five, or six missions, we saw a land invader ship. Um, I can give you a guess of what we found, but. It definitely was fun, and we had to run from it. <laughs> and I was, it was pain. I gave you a hint. It's something that you shouldn't be seeing in September. Double time. You got down with the video. On it. And that the lit terror went fine actually. It was very scary because well, it turned into a no, it went fine. That was just my initial reaction of opening a door and seeing nine lids, but we saved 10 civilians, surprisingly. As it turns out, when you kill most of the lids, civvies don't die, but... There was no cyberness, there was no mech toy, there was just a very tanky, um... Seeker. So, it was very... Underwhelming, surprisingly. Yeah, it was mild pretty much. Like I was thinking there'd be there would be sex toy commanders and back toys and no. Even the first one was tame. I've got a lot of heat on me. I forget what the first terror had, but of, of September, but I remember it not being that terrifying compared to Newfoundland 2. Solid now, um, the raider, the landed raider was a trap. The first pod we saw had a heavy floater leader. And unfortunately, we act it activated on its own terms and we couldn't get an angle, so we just said F this, evac. We were like right at the entrance, so. It was just a shrug moment of we had to leave because I didn't want someone to get one shot. Um, September 15th, I think. Around that time. No, actual September 15th. Or 14th. So yeah, super early. I know if it being trapped, it's early, but not something I. Yeah, I have no words. Negative damage. I just realized that's gonna kill it when it runs, isn't it?
Okay, we may end up just killing it by accident. That's fine. No. Or... Sure. Excellent work. All objectives complete. Well, Sangro would not be placed, but it wasn't trapped. Oh, Javis, the one, the one time the UFO is a trap, it turns into a two-hour ordeal. I applaud the low mod, no mod run going. Yeah, no mods, just a bunch of second wave options. Although it seems like these, I, these I wonder why I put the extra damage for that. Well, RNG damage roll. Um, whatever the second wave option that that heavily skews the um, damage roll because we really did lowball a lot of shots. Yeah, damage for that. This screen support, yeah, so just take fuel surgeon. That's pretty sniper. Um Will this be your in the zone person? Because I have yet to build one. That's funny. Yeah, an attack sense <laughs> on a cyber build. Yeah, it may it might as well be because for crit. I don't think about it. I have op I have other cypress. I, I have other cypress I can worry about later. You're definitely a tandem. So a tandem rocketeer. Heat ammo on the NG is always a nice utility. And Bolt finally gets concealment, congrats. Four dance of disc, a couple drones, a lot of alloys that we desperately needed. And nothing up. And a singular melt can. Rats ball, you survived long enough to get concealment, so you're not you are gonna be alright. But yeah, ten days till GLR. It's September twenty second, so about a week after the Landed Raider, the uh, landed trap uh, Raider. Takes out soon, isn't it? Five days. Um, as for foundry stuff, we've recently done penetrator weapons, which will help our air game a lot. And we're working on a workshop and Satellites for the US. We're gonna try to save Mexico if we can. But there was a bomb disposal in Germany, so panic is fine ish, I guess. Oh, wait, that's not expensive. It's just the uh, alley cost, right? You know what? Sure.
I know just what to sell because we already did the lid autopsy. I mean, the title's Goss Economy. We had to focus on Goss, right? Give me a big Goss Bazooka. That's all. That's all I'm getting because of that from that scout. That's fine. Are we building a salad? No, we haven't built a salad yet, have we? No. We have one that's gonna be launched over Mexico. We need a backup. And that's gonna cost... 164. I could wait two days and buy it then. Yeah, I could wait two days, sure. Receiving several urgent requests for assistance. There are abductions in progress at each marked site on the hollow road. I'm not a surprise. We have time to do this, I think. What is this? Urban block. Six days, sixteen days. I forgot fatiguing a number of people. The question is, do I fatigue injured Dorn? Well, for the Exxon mission, I mean. Probably fatigue injured the corporal, but yeah, we need we definitely need our A team because this is a storm and abduction. It could have what I'm actually fearing would normally be on words. I bring Dorn because we could be seeing a new Aid Lamel that we have yet to see this entire month that is when they should usually appear. Like Jank. Hypermatic Assault, Gunner, Scouts. Half a bowl. Red, we're saving for the Egg Soul mission, but... We could run a fatigue if we have to. And nuts. So I want to bring the capture device, even though we know a specialist this time, because we still need the sector like, capture for um, scientists. Uh, take that instead, and a uh, scope.
Um, Affable just needs a... This might be stuck well with Alex. Probably gonna be Fox, I guess. Either Fox or Red, one of the two. Probably Flux. Oh, no. Probably red. Yeah. I keep thinking I have two Gauss rifles when, I, when one is still being patched up. I see again. No, yeah, never knows that part. Oh. Or when an alien roars loudly to intimidate you. I forgot that test description exists. Alright, um. Yeah, flash AP will do. But if it's all AP because he has tandems and no sapper. Jake's all the all the oh um defense. Yeah, if someone's gonna capture, it's gonna be um deep part. I guess that means Flux will have to scatter device. I mean that motion tracker. Yeah, that was you. Cam, but I have too many specialists. Maybe if I have my support and uh, my support energy, but yeah. Prepare for deployment, strike one. We're going to be putting down in Mexico for this mission. The aliens are continuing to target civilians for abduction in several major cities across the globe. We have to get down there and deploy as soon as possible. Operation Blind Priest. I guess on the plus side, there is no penalty to leaving this place, other than um, Canada will get some panic if we do. This is Big Sky. Strike team is because panic here is already maxed out. So. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage. The Ooh, that's spicy. Um, on there, it's probably like right there, if anything. I want to know what's on the right side. If I'm able to. like a larger version of the sectoid but something is different what is that energy oh that is mean game well there's our latest enemy the sectoid commander 
guarded with two mech lights, because... Yeah. I oh, got my wish. The scout, the the landed scout was in a trap. Yeah, have this instead. Hmm. I have many concerns. Yeah, this is at the, this is right there then. Okay. But yeah, that's definitely spicy. I wish that pod was there and this, but whatever was here was there instead. Cause I definitely don't want people out here. Cause I guess I'm killed by the mechtoids. I guess I'm killed super hard. Play where it lands, but again, I'm about ready to just go and say F the mission. I'm on the move. All right, since I haven't explained what a statutory commander is, since I just spoiled the surprise, it's what it says on the tin. It's a um, it's a oh, special statutory. Ordinarily, you see them in the base in um. I want to say Vanilla XCOM, they're what you see in the base, alien base, and after that, if you don't capture one. In Long War, they have my controllers always. They have a scarier mind merge that mind merges everything around it. And they have better stats, so they are terrifying. The fact that it has two mech toys as guards is I'm on it, Commander. very awkward. I'm just gonna go with Pandora's block paper on the side. The other side is even more terrifying. I'm just gonna say after this and leave. Nope, oh, just don't see it yet. It's there. It could be on the roof, possibly, but I'm willing to, I'm willing to play ball and check. I say that they just finished their shopping, maybe watch some TV while you wait. But I'm not a fan of this of this of this TV station. The fuzzy Um Broken Windows like um that when the fuzzy um screensaver doesn't just doesn't do it for me, you know. Alright, well, what's gonna convince me if I wanna stay or not is knowing if the pods appear. If the game will let me at least have that opportunity. Well, they're not on the roof. Do I trust the roof? I mean, compared to my other options, I trust the roof, but 
I just want to know if I'm just wasting my time just standing here, huh? Well, everyone else is Overwatch because I don't even want to. I don't even want to go down this alleyway because that screams. That scream just squad wipe from this distance. Um, a terrifying one. We found our first sector commander. It has a guard. It has a. Uh... Yeah. Um, the team's good, but it's not that good. I don't think it's ready for two double mech toys, a sector commander, and whatever else is down the alleyway. And there's no shame in running to, from this because this is Mexico. This is a country we're gonna launch a satellite at the end of the month and its panic is already maxed out, so. I'm just testing the waters here, just seeing what the other pod is before I make a commitment or not on this, on this, um, this abduction. Yeah, they're going book shopping. Yeah, exactly. I'm just playing. I want to know what friends it has in the in the alleyway before I do commit. Oh hi! It's not as terrifying and. I would say if I saw this first, I would say yeah, if we do it, then it didn't get ambushed by the mechtoids. Yeah. Oh, yeah, also on like in. Is there word if that's gonna be like a a scarier outsider bet? Unlike in vanilla XCOM, commanders can't come with outsiders instead of. The terror that is mechtoids, so. Um, Mexico's already close to Max Panic because it got focused on twice by terror attacks. So, where Dometer knows that the aliens launching the satellite at the end of the month to try to hold on to North America, well, to um, try to hold on to Mexico at least for October because they have um, near max um, shield, a pack shield. And to possibly get more UFO um, crash landing and such for resources. Because I was planning on doing a base assault in October if we don't get assaulted first to try to get the US back. But we're not going to sell in, in Mexico no matter what. Mexico has already been targeted twice by terror attacks and bombings and such. So that's the plan. Also, high mount. I got know that last after this long, long wind explanation, but I'm confident. I'm not that confident against two mech toys without without the TLR. We're we're going. Roger, Roger. I made my decision. We're we're gone. If this was an abduction that wasn't in Mexico, then I would commit, but Approaching we're gonna launch a satellite here, it's fine. Heading out. Moving out. The only thing that sucks is this probably affects panic in Canada, Heading but out. that's about it. Oh, 
out right away because you're... Yeah. No, uh, Mexico won't leave. Oh, I had another mech toy on top of that. So that's three mech toys, two commanders, and whatever else is in that other pod that just showed up. Mexico won't leave immediately. They were sort of like on that on the fence sort of like fifth barn, so this only this won't do much to it. Either way, we're gone. F this. In the words of the wise, F this crap, I'm out. But now if this was a terror attack, yeah, then this is a terror attack that they get. <laughs> Trader's Brew is a rather nasty shopping trip. Yeah, the irony of brutal difficulty. The game gave me a couple mick gimmies and in the moment it, I do an actual abduction, it gives me that. We will be in touch, Commander. Yeah, they're already at max out, so that didn't really do much, just her can a little bit. It's fine. The game knowing exactly when to raise the middle finger is concerning is concerning behavior though. Additional workshop online. I would love one more interceptor, but I might have to buy it at the beginning of the month. Just to try to save some cash. Well. We get some cash from Exalt. Assuming we don't get screwed over by the by the mission top again. Also, once you patch, I'll push you on seeing race, I guess. Argentina wants seekers for NGs. Mm. Argentina is cool on, on um, pack, right? Um, actually, it's not. I was thinking Brazil. On a nice eat irony, the game wanted us to capture a sectoid, and yeah, on that map, F that. And as we see a mission in three days, I don't think we're getting that sectoid request, that's, and that's fine. Sure, take him. Also, congrats, Bruce. Your limbs are no, are, have been reattached. Congrats. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Also, I realize what Bruce's nickname should be. Bruce Diehard Willis. Right, you're a marauder. I'll think about your build later, but I'm just curious. Right, the main thing of Marauders, they go in and they go in hard, right. It's just been a while since I've seen a Marauder skill tree, but... Actually, wait, we may end up sending you on the Exxon mission if it's not the, the bad variant. Keep my options open, I guess. You know, Sox is done. Codename Backfire. Thousand rumors and charlatans over the centuries, and yet, in a matter of weeks, we prove it is true. Humans with suitable training and tech assistance can manipulate reality by thought alone. We're still arguing where to call this new branches of human experience, psionics or noetics, but one thing is certain over suitable investment of resources, we could begin training our tech. Could train some of our talent and specialized techniques to assist them in the battlefield. So I, love, I definitely do want because 
to complete the game, you need science. A specific, we, well, you need science, period. There's no going around it, unlike mechs and off, unlike mechs and officers and gene bots, you need scions to actually beat the game. That opens up all their secondaries when, once you get to that point. I mean, I did say we need operations regardless. How much does it cost to make a key again? Because I always forget. Yeah, I was thinking it costs a lot. I was thinking it costs a metric ton of alloys. And meld. All right. Yeah. I definitely said we do need to do this at some point. We'll just do it now, I guess. Alternatively, we do Illyrium and that opens up um, armor, but I think we need this done first. Yeah, op um, operations first. Nothing will ever be the same. The work that we've done here to adapt the technology of a hostile enemy force has advanced the scientific progress of mankind by untold generations. These weapons, these abuses of science, we still have an opportunity to use them for a greater good. We have paid a heavy price, but our efforts have not been in vain. I think about this conversation, I think about XCOM 2, and yeah, we totally will put the good use. Totally. Well, just a time for the covert up, I guess. Now the good variant. Hmm. Oh, so I know we only did like one mission technically, but I'm gonna save that for future me because I do need to think about this Marauders build. Because I believe our other mechs are still being patched up because we sent them out fatigued. That was a poor Jason, still out for a month. Yeah, Pathfinder's out for hmm. I mean, still options. No, oh, voice is back. Well, I still want to think about this Marauder's build because I don't see myself chopping up a fourth person anytime soon. Because. It costs 40 mil to chop someone up, and I need the mail for other, for other um, things. 60 mil. Okay, a lot, a lot more than that. Yeah, so I'm gonna take up all this Marauders build, and we'll come back tomorrow after after fleshing out his build. We're gonna deal with Exalt again, and hope we don't get. And hope we don't see any more terrifying things like this last, like this abduction we just evac out of.